My name is Alishpa Rafi and my story name is I Had to Keep My Promise. Well, that's the end of our class, students. I have organized a tricky test on the first three chapters for you that will be held next Friday. Be sure to revise it well. Goodbye, said Miss Sana as she picked up the rest of her things and went outside. Students began filing out of the classroom in eager to reach the school bus in time. How do you feel about the test, Amna? asked Sarah as they took their usual seats in the bus. I am not too good in science, so I may need some help. Can I ask you a favor? I want you to help me in this. Of course, I promise. I'll come to your house each evening to study and help, exclaimed Sarah. During the days that followed, she made helpful notes for them both so that they would study together each evening with benefit. When something terrible happened, mother came in on Saturday morning. Sarah, leave your studies and pack a few things. We are going, she said. To where? asked Sarah helplessly. To your grandmother's. She is in Peshawar and terribly sick. Your aunt, on the other hand, has to go for an important meeting, so hurry up. When everything was ready, they sat in the car and drove off. Sarah hesitated and told her parents the sad story. Too bad I didn't bring the internet device. My phone even has almost no data, said mother. Meanwhile, Amna was tired of waiting. The phone beside her rang. She picked up the phone, amazed to find Sarah calling her, who had to tell her story once more. I will call you tomorrow to study, she finished. After all, I had to keep my promise.